Hey, see y'all decided to go shopping with me again, huh? Well, listen, I got some bad news. For all those that were waiting for a video for Skillet, it ain't gonna happen. I put it up, it was up for one day. So for those of you who got to see it, congratulations. For the rest of you, you just, you just shit out of luck, I'm sorry. Because YouTube, like I knew they would, would say that I was copyright infringement. I didn't, I didn't feel like fighting it, arguing it, contesting it. So, I went ahead and took it down. Try to save my channel. I'm sorry. It's just the way it goes. You know how it is? So, y'all just, y'all have to just go to a Skillet concert and see them in live. It's so much better. It's so much better than seeing it on video. I'm telling you, they put on one heck of a show. Even for them being a Christian band. Mm hmm. Yep, that's right. Y'all got to Here's see it. Here's a true them. story. Me and my younger brother, we went to a store, it's called Tractor Supply. We have these in our state, I'm not sure if y'all have them in your store, um, but it stormed really bad this day. It was so bad that the power went out in the whole area. So it, all the businesses, everything was without power. Now, you know how some of these businesses, they'll have their emergency lights, you know, just to kick on when their power goes off. But, you know, that's what power, uh, Tractor Supply did. They had just a few that came on. Well, they let everybody in so we could do our shopping. Look what we were looking for. So, as we were standing there, looking at something, this husband and wife walks in and he says, what did they forget to turn their lights on or something? And I looked at my brother and I just had to do it. I was like, uh, no, they left their lights off so they can save on their light bill. Here's your sign. <laughs> Me and my brother, some of the employees, we just all broke out laughing. The guy took it as as a fun joke too, you know. But he just, I, I don't know. Why would you think a business wouldn't have their lights on? <laughs> so anyway, uh, I got to do some shopping. So I'll get back with you. See you. Got a question for you. How many of y'all own one of these? For all of those that do, I'm jealous. I'm looking for one right now to see what I could afford. I, I really don't want nothing too big. Gets to be a little too much in price. So, I've been looking at some of the smaller ones. Another thing I wanted to ask is, how many of y'all spend y'all's money on these? Huh? How many of y'all actually spend money on all these movies and still watch them? Don't y'all just hit it when you go to one store, you know where something's good, you like. Then you come to a big store like this, and they don't have it. But that other store that does have it is all the way across town. God, I really don't want to have to go all the way across town to go get just that one item that I like. So I might have to put it on hold and wait for it another day. 
you can feel it's so good. That's what I call my little midnight snack. Yeah, yeah. So I got to do without. So. Need to send a letter to Walmart and say, look, get this product over here so I ain't got to go across town for it. Nah, ain't going to happen. I got another question. This is for all you guys out there. How many of y'all like to do shopping? I'm talking about grocery shopping. Huh? Come on, admit it. Let's see who's all brave enough to admit that they like to go shopping. I like it. I used to like going with when I was married. Uh, y'all might get a little cold, so y'all hold on. Y'all going in the freezer. Um, but yeah, I've always went shopping. See, I found that. If you go shopping, you get to pick out some of the things you like. And then if you're single, like me, you have to do the shopping. The only way you're going to eat. Just trying to choose what I want. Anyway, for all those that are brave enough to admit it, write it down in the comments. See how many I get that are brave enough to say they like to go shopping. You see, again, another product. You get in a grocery store, but they don't have it here in this big, I'm not even gonna say it, this big store. You know what I'm saying? I love extra creamy whipped cream, and they don't have it here. I don't get it. You'd figure that'd be like a really good seller. I like it. I like to keep it in the freezer and eat it like ice cream, but they don't have it. So I guess I'm going to have to go across town anyway, just to get the couple. Now it's going to be a couple of things that I need. So. It, it's almost making it worthwhile for me to go there anyway. Jesus. Why, people? I gotta spend extra money and gas to get over there. Uh, I mean, it's not too much in gas because, I, you know, I do drive a little Geo Metro, so I'm um, not spending too much money on gas. It's just still the thought that I have to go over there anyway. You, you know, so I think I'm just gonna quit buying uh, stuff here that I need today and just finish getting the stuff that I need over there. This way I'll make sure it's worth my uh, trip, you know what I'm saying? So, I think I, uh, you know, buy me something that I, I really need to stay away from and that's my favorite ice cream. So, I need it. I haven't had it in a while. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and spend a few extra bucks and get it. I, uh, don't mind me, I, I, I know I'm kinda staying quiet there for a second. I'm just trying to think of the stuff that I need. I know. Don't tell me. Why don't you make a grocery list? Because I'm a man. Guys don't write grocery lists. We just go to the grocery store. You know that. So, anyway, I'm looking for a checkout counter so I can check out. And that means that I'll check y'all out later. Like I always say. Y'all behave yourselves.